It's time for some crazy bars that are gonna go way over my damn head. What is going on, y'all? It's your man, Jeff, and we are back with another one. First off, and as always, guys, it is damn good to see y'all, man. I hope that you guys are out there doing fucking awesome, man, for real. But Jam Baxter, I fucking love this guy, man. It seems like every time I hear him, I just fall in love with him even more. And especially since the last reaction, I think it was... Fuck, I'm not sure who it was. Man, I gotta get on that. But somebody had commented and was like, Hey man, you're not supposed to grasp what he says, man. You're supposed to just really just listen to it for the imagery that he projects. And when I read that, man, it was like, y'all two just put the puzzle. Hello, the cat just jumped out of the closet, scared the fuck out of me. There you go. Hey, buddy. Didn't even know you were back there. Hold on, hold on. There you go. Appears. Every damn day. But anyway, <laughs> since I read that comment, man, it became a lot fucking easier. Like I said, y'all two just put the freaking pieces together and it's like, oh, okay, so that's what you're supposed to do. I don't know. It just makes it easier to react. Makes it easier for my head. Less to think about, I guess. But anyway, man, let's get into this. It's Jam Baxter fucking bulletproof. I know this is gonna be freaking heat. I don't even know if I understand a word. But let's go. This is recording, man. Right? Yeah. Summer nights are something about my only achievements. God damn, bitch. If that ain't ring true right now, summer is flying by. We already pretty much in September. Yeah. These wasted summer nights are all perennial achievements. I offer Viking burials and see at your convenience. Peace. Peace. I'll catch you in Valhalla. Roll on stage, neck a jogger, gin and shout at your outflank your Pencil movement. Features looking at your malnourished children drooling And you wonder why you're disillusioned Maybe you're just terrified of dying as a wrinkled human I ain't gonna move an inch from lounge Oh my god, bring it back Looking at your malnourished children drooling He talking into a fan <laughs> I'll flank your pincer movements Features looking at your malnourished children drooling And you wonder why you're disillusioned Maybe you're just terrified of dying as a wrinkled human Gonna move an inch, I'm lounging Raid the fridge with telescopic arms Dow sim Catch me in the age, reacting, drowning Scuba dive through my life in rotten terrorist housing I am not tied, glued or cable tied to anything Fuck the week of he says you weasels a president I could fill a cannon with the dead weight I'm severing Probing veins coursing with adrenaline I ride an old June buggy with the slash brakes Riding shotty with a gas clad in black lace Perform at the apocalypse backstage. Jesus on the cello and the devil playing slap bass. Oh, yeah, God. demon on the tap. Jesus on the treble with the devil playing slap bass. Not even using a pick. Damn. Jesus on the cello and the devil playing slap bass. Yeah. On the cello or on the treble. Either way, it was fucking awesome. Apocalypse backstage. Jesus on the cello and the devil playing slap bass. Yeah, demon on the tambourine, arms like tentacles, sculpted out of plasticine. And I'm still doing dirt, so you must be fucking tripping if you think my grubby hands are clean. Another week, another relapse, but you ain't gotta worry about me. So see me a bullet playing feedback. I'm clocked out to double now, G. Yeah, we might be crippling our organs, but you ain't gotta worry about us. Still bulletproof villains living all us. Yeah, we still shutting down cars. Look, yeah, I see what these needles do. That's why I never touched them, never needed to. Let alone in humanity, never on a 2 a.m. stairwell, buried in forever. Yeah, I hope you found peace finally. I hope you're off the ground. I understand why you're to me. But lost my. Ooh, 
I hope you found peace finally. I know you're off the brown. I understand why you lied to me. Damn. Never wanna see where you stand well, Ben. We did forever. Yeah, I hope you found peace finally. I hope you're off the brown. I understand why you lied to me. But last month I barely lose three meters. Sat at your bell and big dealers. Oh, the irony, anyway. Fuck the sentimental shit. Still a stir, crazy, reckless, henny, naked, head in it. Still the gold medalist. I keep 56 weighing down my neck cause it's decorative I slip the ribbons in a heartbeat and hand them all straight to these curvy dirty stop outs I have a call Yeah, me and her used to fuck a lot Yeah, but now I got a number block It's funny how your brethren turn their back on you Just cause there's some freezing cold shit you're trying to battle through I thought you were all people Damn Woo Let's hear that again Just cause there's some freezing Hold on. Now I got a number block. It's funny how your brethren turn their back on you. Just cause there's some freezing cold shit you're trying to battle through. You're damn right. It's funny how your friends will turn your back on you. Just because there's some freezing cold shit you're trying to hack your way through or whatever the hell he said. That is the fucking truth, man. You're going through some hard times, man. You're either going to have one of two people. Either A, they're still going to love you. Or B, they're gonna turn around and say, you different, you changed. Hell fucking no, I'm just going through some shit. Maybe I am changing. And if you ain't with it, you ain't with it, man. Like, that's one of the hardest lessons I ever had to learn. Is that your friends ain't really your friends. <laughs> I mean, some of them are, man. Like I said, some of them, when you're in hard times, will come out of the woodwork and be like, oh, fuck, thanks, man. But the people, the most people that you think will always be there for you usually ain't. And they will fucking turn on you. That's why I try to tell people, man, if you can master learning how to be alone and loving to be alone by yourself, enjoying your you time, you can tackle anything in life, man. Like, to be honest, I feel bad for people that have to have somebody in their life to make them feel justified, you know what I mean? Like, I don't feel like a whole person if I'm not in a relationship. Well, damn, dude, it looks like you got some work to do. Like, I got friends that are like that. Like, before I got with this girl here, I had people in my inbox. Why don't we hang out? Why don't we do this? All oh, you nasty hoes, get away from me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Damn, because I know when the time gets hard, y'all ain't going to be there. Y'all just want a piece of meat. <laughs> nah, nah, I ain't like that, man. I'm not a dude who can sleep with a bunch of dudes. <laughs> I'm not a dude who can sleep with a bunch of dudes. Well, no shit. <laughs> I'm not a dude who can sleep with a bunch of girls, man. Maybe it's because I was raised by a single mom, so I got, like, a wick of respect for women. But, man, some people are just sleazy and are only with you so the stuff that they can gain from you. And it's usually in those dark, cold times when that shit comes out, man. What a fucking man or woman. It don't fucking matter what a fire that was. All right, let's go back. <clears throat> I keep 56 weighing down my neck cause it's decorative I slip the ribbons in a heartbeat and hand them all straight to these curvy dirty stop outs I have a call Yeah, me and her used to fuck a lot Yeah, but now I got a number block It's funny how your brethren turn their back on you Just cause there's some freezing cold shit you're trying to battle through I thought you of all people understood I back you with the Air Max one was on the other foot in the dark nights, the fireflies cower. You ever jealous eyes crying icy white shower? In the dark nights, the fire, the fireflies cower. Damn! In the dark nights, the fireflies cower. You ever jealous eyes crying icy white shower? Sour. Woo! But shit's blessed. I ain't shed a solitary tear since that bitch left. Another week, another relapse. But you ain't gotta worry about me. Be a bullet point feedback. I dropped out to juggle now, G. Yeah, you might be crippling our organs, but you ain't gotta worry about us. Still bulletproof villains living all us. Yeah, we still shutting down cars. I fucking like that one. And I'll tell you right now, or I'll tell you why right now. Number one, it was real personal about him. And number two, the video was shot, it looks like it was shot with an old 90s flip phone. I fucking love that, man. It just gives a raw feel to it. Like, 
You can tell this dude just probably he sits in that apartment, man, and just plays the beat and just bleep, he probably wrote that so freaking easy, man. You know what I mean? Like we would be sitting over here struggling, be like, oh, that bar is not good enough. That bar is not good enough. Blah 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 blah. Hell no, this dude, man, he just <clears throat> he makes it seem like it's so fucking easy. And for him and Jest and Chester P, man, it it fuck ah. Like I've said multiple freaking times, man, there is just something, the way their brains work, different than anybody else that I've ever fucking heard of, man. Like, it's... I can't... The Wu-Tang is probably the closest that I can think about. And I don't even know a lot about them, as y'all knew, because I didn't know who Inspector Deck was. <laughs> but... Like, those abstract type of different bars, man. I can't really think of anybody else that does it like those three. And it's fucking amazing, man. So shout out to Jam Baxter as always, baby. And shout out to you guys as well for being the best motherfuckers around. Hell yeah. I hope y'all know that and fucking believe it, man. Because if it wasn't for y'all, I don't know what I would be doing right now. You know what I mean? Probably would have relapsed a long fucking time ago, and who fucking knows? <laughs> but, thankfully, man, we here, we building, we less than a hundred away from two fucking grand. Are you kidding me? Kabamo! It's blowing my fucking head off, man. It's insane, dude. So, thank you to you guys as always. I appreciate y'all so much. From the bottom of my heart, guys, I love you. And I will catch you in the next one, alright? Peace out, baby.